Over the years, tattoos and body modifications have become significantly more popular, whether that's done as a form of self-expression, the need to stand out, or just to fill a void. But in this video, we're gonna dive into the world of extreme and learn about 10 people whom some might say took their tattoos a bit too far. Number 10, Magneto, a 72 year old man who happens to be the most tattooed person in Germany. In case you're wondering how he got the name Magneto, well, that's thanks to his body modifications. He has 17 implants and some of those are magnetic and could attract small objects. Magneto started off as a post office worker, but wanted to stand out, so he got his first tattoo at the age of 46, a teardrop under his eye, and from there continued getting more ever since. So far he's got 98% of his body covered in tattoos along with many other modifications like piercings, the reshaping of his ears, and the tattooing of his eyeballs. Number 9, Eli Ink, a tattoo artist who blacked out his entire body with several coats of ink. Eli wants to push all boundaries and take things as far as possible, finding out just how much ink the human body can physically hold. His interest in tattoos first started when his uncle came home with a big tribal piece. At the age of 17, Eli got his first tattoo which according to him was in basic traditional style and within 3-4 to four years he started blacking out his entire body. Alongside his many tattoos, he also has other modifications including the tattooing of his eyeballs, stretching of his nose, ears and bottom lips. His goal is to be the most tattooed man in history, which would mean having more tattoos than the current record holder, Lucky Diamond Rich. Number 8, Ted Richards, aka the Parrot Man. Ted's obsession with parrots caused him to transform his body to resemble one. The first change he made was tattooing feather-like images on his face. After that, he tattooed one of his eyeballs blue and the other one red. It didn't stop there because he then removed the flaps of his ears saying parrots don't have ears like us. Unfortunately though, that procedure caused him to have some hearing issues. His other modifications include many piercings, split tongue, a few horn implants and the reshaping of his nose to resemble a more beak-like look. He says the more he looks like a parrot, the happier he becomes. Number 7, Donnie Snyder, a former forklift driver who covered the majority of his body in blue. Donnie's low self-esteem and being uncomfortable with who he was pushed him to make this drastic change, saying he decided to quit hiding and remake his life to how he'd like it to be. In 2017, his sister inked a part of his leg blue and he liked it so much that he decided to continue the project and expand it onto his entire body. This extreme change gave him a big boost of happiness. So if he's happy, I guess that's all that really matters. Number 6, Matthew Whelan, one of Britain's most tattooed men. He got his first one when he was 16 years old, and many years later, he completely transformed his body, spending over $40,000 on body modifications and tattoos. He even went as far as removing both of his nipples to provide a smoother canvas for the ink. Not only that, but Matthew also has his eyeballs tattooed black, split his tongue, and changed his name to body art. Unfortunately for him though, a few years ago he was at risk of losing his arm. In 2015, he wanted a knuckle duster implant under his skin to represent his days as a fighter. However, his body rejected the foreign object and ended up splitting his skin. Since then, Matthew underwent a procedure to remove the implant and says his drastic body transformation wasn't for the need of attention or to hide himself away from the world. He says it's simply for him. It's a hobby and a lifestyle that he enjoys. Number 5, Matt Gone, the checkered man. Matt has 99% of his body covered in tattoos, getting work done by more than 140 different artists. The most dangerous thing he's done was tattooing his own eyeballs, saying do not try this at home, leave it to the professionals. Alongside all of that, he also has tattoos on the inside of his mouth and in his throat. However, his checkered face is what really grabs the attention of people. When asked why checkers, he said, Nobody hates checkers. I've never known a single person who had a negative feeling towards checkers. Unfortunately, Matt suffers from a few birth defects. Having one side of his body underdeveloped and missing his left kidney, lower left bicep, and major pectoral muscle. But he says getting tattoos helped him enjoy his body by hiding his scars and birth defects, basically giving him a life that he loves. Number 4, Julia Ganussi, the world's most tattooed woman. At the age of 35, Julia was diagnosed with porphyria, a rare disorder that caused her skin to break out in very painful lesions when it was exposed to the sun. This unfortunate event caused her skin to scar up, and in order to cover those scars, she turned to tattoos. Julia started with her legs first, and it quickly became an obsession. Soon after, the tattoos spread onto her stomach, arms, and back. 
As her skin condition became worse, she decided to take the final step and tattoo her entire face, meaning 95% of her body was now covered in ink putting her in the world's Guinness Book of Records as the most tattooed woman in the world. In the last year of her life, she tried getting rid of her tattoos using laser treatment, but unfortunately passed at the age of 61. Number 3, Rick Jenis, aka Zombie Boy, an actor and model who holds the world's record for having the most bones tattooed on his body. Jenis was diagnosed with a brain tumor early on and he was on the wait list for 6 months before he could go through the procedure that could help him. During that time, he was contemplating his life and death. However, after the successful operation, Jenis began his journey to turn himself into a walking body of art. His unique look landed him a few gigs as a model, and he finally got his big break appearing in Lady Gaga's music video, Born This Way. It didn't stop there because he then went on to model for Jay-Z's fashion label and acted alongside Keanu Reeves. Unfortunately though, Jenis passed away at the age of 32 after falling off the third floor of a building. Number 2. Horace Riddler aka The Great Omi Sometimes referred to as Zebra Man, Horace came from a wealthy family and served twice for the British Army. However, in 1922, he decided to devote his life to show business and that's where he began his journey to get tattooed. It wasn't until 1927 when he decided to push the envelope further and get big bold zebra-like stripes and thus giving birth to The Great Omni. Alongside his unique tattoos, he also stretched out his ears, septum, and hired a dentist to sand down his teeth to make them more pointy. Omi traveled the world as a famous sideshow performer and ended up retiring at the height of his career. Living from 1882 to 1965, he deserves massive respect because back then, tattoos were an absolute taboo and having as many as he did was absolutely unheard of. So respects there. Number 1. Anthony Lefredo, The Black Alien Project This UK man has done a number of procedures to make himself look like a real life alien. From a very young age, he's been passionate about transforming the human body. It all clicked one day working as a security guard, realizing he wasn't living life the way he wanted to. So he decided to do something about it. Anthony blacked out his entire body in ink, tattooed his eyeballs, split his tongue, added many subdermal implants, along with many other body modifications. Since he began his transformation, he swears that he's the happiest he's ever been, and despite all of that, he says he's only 30% done. Now, there's a lot more to this story and it gets really deep, which is why I'm gonna make a separate detailed video about this individual, so if you don't wanna miss that, make sure to subscribe with the bell notification turned on. And if you like this video, consider checking out parts one, two, and three of this series on my channel. Don't forget to smash the like button. I love you all so much and I'll see you guys in the next one.